So uh, first we need to look at, uh, we, need to, uh, uh, we need to find out uh, the distribution of states and that is basically to get the concept of macro states and mac micro states. So uh, distribution of states uh, is nothing but uh, we need to find out, we, we want to find out excuse me, uh, how particles are distributed in different energy states. We will we'll take two examples and those two examples uh, will uh, give you clear idea what you mean by uh, distribution of states um, uh, in, in, in quantum system and that will propagate to classical system um, for statistical thermodynamics uh, uh, for biological uh, molecules. Now, we will take the example 1. So, in example 1, we will be basically looking at distribution of 4 indistinguishable particles uh, who are distributed in 2 energy states. Let us uh, write it down. So, uh, we are looking at distribution of 2, uh, distribution of 4 particles in 2 energy states. So, uh, let us say energy states are epsilon 1 and epsilon 2. So, um, here uh, I will be using uh, epsilon for, uh, uh, for, for the energy and for the total energy I will be using capital E. So, epsilon 1 and epsilon 2 are basically the energy of state 1 and state 2. Now, we, we I said that we have 4 particles. So, how can you distribute 4 particles in these 2 energy states? So, one distribution is I put all 4 particles here. I can make another distribution where I can put 3 particles here, 1 particle here. I can have another distribution where I, par I put 2 particles here and 2 particles up there. I can have another distribution where I put one particle here, three particle up there and putting all four particles in the E2 state. So, how many distributions you got? So, you got five such distribution and these five are called the macro states. So, for a four particle systems, with two energy states, we can have five macro states. Now, let us look at this particular macro state, which we name as 2, 2, which defines that two particles are in epsilon 1 state and two particles in the epsilon 2 state. So, if now the particles, if the particles are distinguishable, Sorry. So, by, uh, uh, by, by the term distinguishable, I mean that these 4 particles they differ from each other and you can distinguish them and so the, those 4 particles are let us say P, Q, R and S. In this case, uh, they are all same. So, here my particles are distinguishable. So, if these 4 particles are distinguishable for this 2, 2 macro state, how many different distributions we can have. So, let us look at it. So, we have epsilon 1, epsilon 2 and we have 2 up there, p q up there and we have r s down here because we have 2, we are, we are basically looking at uh, this particular uh, macro state. So, we can have p q up, r s down, we can have PR up, QS down, we can have PS up and QR down. So, we have 3 state, we also can have RS PQ, we also can have QS PR and we also can have QR PS. Do you have any other possibility? I do not think so. So, what you basically see here that for a 2, 2 macro state, we have 6 different distributions and these 6 
are called the microstates. Okay. So, for a 2 2 macrostate, we have 6 microstates. So, likewise, for uh, other macrostate, you can have uh, different number of microstates as, as you can uh, find it out uh, uh, in, uh, in your laser. Uh, now, let us uh, look at uh, the uh, second uh, look at the second example and the second example was uh, uh, five particle system uh, let us uh, go back and see. So, the example 2 was we want to see the distribution of four indistinguishable particle. So, here we have a restriction the restriction is the total energy should fulfill as 5 epsilon. So, again you are talking about four particle system, but um, we are uh, looking at sorry, we are looking at the total energy um, 5 E. So, we uh, let us say we have different energy states. So, we have energy state the ground state 0 E, 1 E, we have 2 epsilon ok uh, epsilon not E. 3 epsilon, 4 epsilon, 5 epsilon. These are the different energy states. And uh, we have uh, we have 4 particles and we have um, total energy 5 E. So, that we have to keep that in mind. So, I can have 1 particle here. I can have 3 particles here. Uh, so, this is a, it's a 4 particle system. So, it does not uh, fulfill. Uh, so, if I have 4 particles, so this total energy is 3 E. So, therefore, this is not the right distribution. So, what will be the distribution? So, we can have 2 particles here one particle here, one particle here. So, what is the total energy now? So, we have 2 cross 2 4 plus 1 5 E. So, this is a this is the right uh, macro state. Now, now, now let us look at uh, other possibilities. So, I am just extending this. Uh, and we will be basically counting how many macro states we have for this particular system of four indistinguishable particles with total energy 5 E. Now, we can have another distribution where we have one particle here and all three here, right. So, that also sums up to uh, 5 epsilon we can have uh, one particle here at 4 E, one at 1 E and two in ground state. So, that is also total 5 E. So, we can also have we have 3 plus 2 yeah no we, we have we can have one here, we can have one here and we have two there. What are the other possibilities do you have? Um, so, so we can also have 3 plus 1. We can also have 3 particles. We did not, uh, yeah, 3 here, 1 here. So, that is 3 plus 2, 5. Do you have any more? Uh, we, do you have any more ways to distribute? Uh, Let us look at it. Uh, there should be one more. There should be one more. Um, 1 plus 4 is done. 1 plus 4 is done. 3 plus 2 is also done. Uh, 4 plus 1, 3 plus 2, uh, 5 plus 0 is also done. Uh, let me look at my note. There should be one more. Uh, with 3 1 is over 
three here one there two one two one is there one okay so we can have one more where we have here two there yes and three right so do you have any more possibility no so these are the six macro states you get for this four particle systems with total energy five epsilon now um, we, we, we name this uh, distribution as um, no let's say uh, sorry uh, let's look at this particular distribution which we name as uh, 1 3 0 distribution and we look at this particular distribution which we name as 2 1 1 so why 2 1 1 because we have two particles in this state we have one particle in this state you have one particle in the state and this is 1 3 0 we have one particle in this state 3 here 0 here so now the question is uh, what will be the number of microstates microstates in uh, 2 1 1 and 1 3 0 uh, 1 3 0 macrostates number of mac mac microstates in these two macrostates we want to find out so again um, so for that uh, we, we uh, say that particles are distinguishable so now the particles are again distinguishable and they are sorry they are p q r s so let's look at uh, for 130 distribution um, how how many mi mi microstates uh, we can have so we have uh, one three and zero microstate and so we have energy state 0 e 1 e and 2 e so we have p we have q r s we have q we have p r s we have r we have p q s we have s and p q r so these are the four four different uh, four different uh, microstates do you have any other microstates for this uh, uh, macrostate 130 i guess no so this particular uh, uh, macrostate is having four microstates Now let's look at the the other distribution we took as two one one yes we took as two one one so what will be the distribution for this particular macrostate so we can have uh, pq r s we have p r q s we have p s q r and then we have q r p s we have 
QSPR. We also have uh, RSPQ. Do you have other states? Yes. So these are six uh, microstates. We can also have six more. So basically, we have PQ, SR. They are still two, one, one microstates. We have PR, SQ. We have PS. R Q, we have Q R S P, we have Q S R P, we have R S Q P. So all of them are signifying that two one one distribution so for this two one one macro state we got total 12 microstates right okay so now let's uh, um, so so we have seen the distribution of states uh, 